At Nepean Hospital, we have a multidisciplinary treatment team that patients have access to that involves a liver specialist, an endocrinologist, dietitian, physiotherapist, exercise physiologist, and psychologist. Our research focuses on longitudinal studies, looking at predictors of outcomes of fatty liver disease, where we collaborate with colleagues at other institutions. Secondly, we have a number of clinical trial programs looking at therapeutic agents to treat fatty liver disease. We focus on non-alcoholic fatty liver disease because it is a common cause of liver cirrhosis and will become the number one cause of liver death in Australia. The profile of the patients that attend our clinic have changed over recent years. At the same time, we have a greater proportion of patients with non-alcoholic fatty liver disease because of a sedentary lifestyle and bad eating habits with increasing prevalence of obesity. The decision to train here at Nipi and Hospital Hepatology Unit for me was a no-brainer. The opportunities that this unit provides to its trainees are vast and endless. The Hepatology Unit at Nipi and Hospital has a national reputation in research and education in both gastroenterology and hepatology. During my time here at Nipi and Hospital, I had the opportunity to participate in national and international clinical trials that offers a cutting-edge therapy to a wide variety of liver conditions. This has allowed me to apply the latest technology and advances in hepatology into my patient's care. Pharmacogenetics is an increasing area of scientific research and development. It is a way by which a patient's genes can be assessed to determine their response to medications and therapies. Pharmacogenetics is important because it allows us to predict which patients will respond to certain therapies, thereby providing symptom relief and possibly cures, but also not instigating therapies that are unlikely to work because of an unfavourable genetic makeup for the patient. The benefit of pharmacogenetic studies is that you are able to predict from these gene studies those patients that may be most likely to respond to a certain medication. Many patients have already benefited from pharmacogenetic studies. This part of Sydney is the fastest growing part of Australia virtually and we have the highest density of fast food outlets here and the result of that is that we have a higher rate of obesity than of overweight which is quite unique. So in this environment, it makes complete sense to address the problem of obesity, diabetes, and cardiovascular health. And here we have created a metabolic health service, which actually addresses the lifespan issue of metabolic health issues. So we see patients from preconception to the grave. So that's the lifespan approach we have taken. The head of the Pian Blue Mountain Metabolic Health Service, Dr. Catherine Williams, is an endocrinologist with a special interest in non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. At the same time, we have a world-class leader of research in that area, Professor Martin Weltman. They two work very closely together, and what we have is referral patterns now that patients from his service can access the Metabolic Health Service to address the problem of obesity and the other way around that patients from the Obesity Metabolic Health Service can access gastroenterology services. That makes this collaboration quite unique. So a multi-team approach is critical here to address the problem of non-alcoholic fatty liver disease and to find solutions for the problem. Seamless clinical care between the two services is central to good care for patients and that's happening. So patients with obesity, diabetes, can be referred to the gastroenterology team and vice versa. Patients will definitely benefit from this and it is good for them to know that they have these opportunities to access these services. And we know that patients who are enrolled in clinical trials always do much better than those who receive routine care. NASH is a growing epidemic worldwide. Here at Nepean Hospital, clinical trial research is done to find suitable therapy, and investigator-initiated NASH research is done to determine the pathogenesis of NASH, and it is critical for today's population. I know this research will make a difference in many people's lives in years to come. Martin and his team is very engaged with the Division of Medicine. We work very closely. Every division has goals, vision, 
that brings them to a common point. It's only recently we set up the obesity service, which is called Family Metabolic Obesity Service. It started in 2017. It's one of the only service that caters for kids, adults, as well as pregnant women. Under Professor Weltman's expertise and his leadership, he brings to Nepean research, cutting edge clinical trials, in particular with non-alcoholic fatty liver disease and teaching as well.